What's going on guys? Welcome back. For those that are new, my name is William Bootsy Blanding. Here's the scenario. Here's where we are. I got the uh, 2017 uh, Ford Fiesta and you know how they say the mechanics tell you to check everything out, make sure everything's good. That's true. I'm not saying anything serious happened, but recently um, I noticed the hood kept, the sensor on the hood kept going off. You know, it's only the hood and I, I'm checking the hood so I know it's, it's latched. So it's not releasing, but it's just annoying to see that constantly going off, telling me the hood's unlatched or whatever. I don't know if it's a uh, computer problem or it's just a sensor but I'm having that checked out it's definitely under the warranty I'm still in the factory warranty guys because when I bought the car from Carvana I had about 66,000 miles on it so it's still in the factory warranty on top of that because I'm the type of person that panics I bought the additional warranty um, the reason why I did that is because I don't want any problems down the line. You know, give me one second, guys. Okay, that's a little bit better. It was a little bit too bright. So the reason why I got the additional warranty is I don't want to have any problems down the line. And you guys can hit me in the comments if you have your opinions, but I'm thinking about renting this vehicle out um, not necessarily to somebody who's doing Uber or Lyft um, I prefer to, to rent it out to somebody that just needs it to get to point A to point B um, but that's where my mindset is right now I'm going to continue doing Uber I did not yet sign up for Lyft and I'm hearing that Lyft is giving a lot more promotions than Uber so I'm gonna put my paperwork in actually today to begin setting up for Lyft. Um, where am I as far as the business structure? Of course, my regular holding company as normal funds go in there to send a check to me. But as far as setting up the new business, I'm kind of waiting until I get some money in the bank. I'll be honest with you guys. Um, of course, I already have the domain. I have the YouTube channel. Um, that's basically just going to be my entity that's going to house and control all this video content. Which is going to be very important later on. Because um, once this video content becomes more valuable, Landrake, the company, will become more valuable. But in the meantime, I'm just going to structure the entity and start building the corporate credit. But I'm going to show you guys how you can fund your LLC or business or holding company, whatever you want to make this be. You can fund it using gig economy. So you're going to walk with me through the journey and I'm going to show you how you can fund it with gig economy. I'm funding it. I'm going to fund it with not only gig economy, but obviously online sales. So you already know where I'm going with mine. But... The car so far hasn't given me any major problems. Again, still in warranty, factory warranty. Um, after, once it goes over 70,000 miles, that's when my warranty I'm paying for will kick in. That's why when my payment is so high. Um, the car was only about 14K, but after, you know, state fees and all that came out to about 18. Um, not a very expensive car, but more than I wanted to spend. You guys have been following me a while. You know, I really only wanted to spend like um, 10, 11 at the most. But we did what we had to do. So we have a vehicle. We get back on the road. Start making this Uber hustle money. In the meantime, I'm promoting my software business still my main uh, 
one of my main opportunities. Um, you definitely want to check the links below for that or just go to WilliamBlanding.com. Just go to WilliamBlanding.com. That'll take you right over to it. And I also have a good capture page for MWR Financial. The combination of these two companies is really a match made in heaven. Um, MWR more so my main opportunity that I'm going to be pushing that hard. So I apologize now if you're already in MWR. If you are already in MWR and you ain't been doing that and you just left it on the back burner, you need to go check out 3.0. Some of you be in these companies so long, you forget that they change up and change things in the back office. So some of you might need to go to your back office and MWR, reopen it up and see what's going on. Because they got a lot going on that's gonna benefit everybody with their finances. I'm gonna actually upload all um, my content to them as far as getting the credit repair stuff going on. Here's what basically they're doing with the credit repair. They're not doing anything elaborate, but it's actually legal. They're not charging people up front to do credit repair or credit restoration or whatever they want to call it. All they're doing is providing you a means, a free means in your package with all these other financial services. They give you the credit repair free. But what also makes it legal is they're not doing it electronically. So they're, all they're doing is providing you the letters. You guys are filling out the letters. So it's legit because the letters are coming from you. So in a sense, we're doing our own credit restoration with the help of NWR Financial. And it's very effective because they say the best way to do it is with the actual letters. I made a mistake and I hired a company, even though technically they're cornered against the law now. I hired a company to do credit repair, paid them up front. Guys, they didn't do jack really that I couldn't have done myself. Not one thing that I couldn't have done myself. So in a sense, it was a waste of time and money. Um, but I realize now, with MWR's help, I can finally be financially free. The combination of the two, the my software business with MWR Financial, and now I got two capture pages now from my capture page. Uh, if you want to see what the capture page go, uh, looks like, just go to either one of my links, my MWR Financial link or my my software business at williamblender.com they both are linked to my capture page that'll get you a feel of why this my capture page is so successful for many different companies because it takes out that funnel process if you're an old head and you want to get online but you don't want to deal with funnels my capture page helps you with this process and you can sign up right through my capture pages. You can check out the opportunities, but you can also go to the bottom of the page and sign up for the My Capture page. If you're already in a business, you might be already in NWR or My Software Business. Or think of almost every affiliate and network marketing company you can think of. They pretty much got a, a, a funnel for everything except Troy Mason's company. 25x club because he's kind of an outcast where he feels like his software is the best so he likes to do his own software um, which to me isn't a big deal anymore guys I am I am technically gonna make Landrake a software publisher company because it's low risk and the beauty about that is you don't have to be technical where you have to go create and control the the, uh, the software. Yes, if something goes wrong with the software, it is in the hands of somebody else. But if you're like me and you have your hands in so many different companies, you don't worry about that. All my eggs are not in one basket because 
even if my capture page went down for a day, whatever, technical problems, I still have the regular sign-up pages that go directly to these opportunities. So I would just simply tell my prospects, give them, send them the link to go directly where they bypass the My Capture page. That's it. You know, so I don't worry about or think it's a big deal to have, oh, I got my own software. And, and we're not part of that the Troy software. I mean, he brags about it like we are a family, but in actuality, thinks it about itself. All those people that got into that black table program lost money. You know, uh, if any of you guys managed to sue, let me know. Hit me in the comments because I would love to find out. Um, I will actually pay for that information. You know what I mean? Provided it's not a scam. Oh, speaking of scams, let me guys tell you what happened lately. This is how I know having a YouTube channel helps you guys and you need to start one. Obviously, I don't get a lot of views. Um, I'm not a big YouTuber yet, but people are watching. Just when I think people aren't watching, people are watching and even the scammers are watching. I got a recent email from a company that it gave me this long, elaborate email about how he started from the bottom, now he's here. But I took it as he was a customer trying to get advice or set up a strategy session with me. But it was actually a sales pitch. And maybe I wasn't paying full attention to the letter because I get so many emails. You know, I really do. I'm not even nobody and I get a lot of emails. So he sends me back, maybe you might have misunderstood, and then tells me in a braggadocious email about all of the, the people he served and how much money he can charge. And, and I'm thinking to myself, you took the time out to watch my YouTube channel, somebody who doesn't have a lot of views, and send me those long elaborate emails, which makes me think you're either a scammer or you're straight up lying about how much business you're doing. Because people doing that kind of business, you don't take the time to individually go watch small YouTubers and pitch them these long ideas, unless you're a scammer. Think about it, guys. I don't even have that kind of time. I don't have that time to just be watching everybody's YouTube video and go and find you because you got to go in the drop down box to even see my email. Email me this long, elaborate pitch to try to sell you guys something. I don't even have that kind of time. This is another reason why I love my business because I don't sell you guys anything. I'm just telling you guys what I'm doing. And either you choose to follow me or you don't. But the beauty is I don't feel like I'm forcing you guys to buy anything. Do I try to encourage you? Of course. You guys sign up and MWR Financial Yes, you're going to benefit me. I'm going to get a quick $50 sale if you sign up as a partner. If you sign up as a regular customer, I make a quick 40 bucks or whatever it is. It's not a big money, but yes, I benefit. But it's going to help your financial life possibly forever. And I really mean that. If you use your NWR financial platform to its fullest which I'm not even yet but if you use it to its fullest it's going to steer you in the direction of financial success because right off the rip you put your information in your, your job information and they're getting you 300 to 600 dollars back in your paycheck and then it's a whole it's a whole another game when you talk about the private reserve account that's a whole another game I got do have videos for that uh, on the channel private reserve account through MWR just sign up you'll see it in your back office but it's basically providing you where you have your own bank you make a large percentage on your money you know you're not losing anything on your money you're only gaining and when this money has enough of your reserve amount in it it's going to take care of your death benefit 
and you're also going to have enough money to borrow, pay yourself back like a real bank. This is a game changer, guys. And in my, this is my opinion, but NWR Financial has probably the best cop plan in network marketing, period. Now, not to say other companies haven't used this same uh, pay structure, but they've been smaller companies that couldn't stay afloat because they were new. NWR has been in business for years. They're not going anywhere. You know, they follow all the laws. They try to get them when that other company shut down because of the credit repair regulations. They did try to come at MWR Financial. They did try. But they, their legal team and the way they market their credit restoration, not credit repair, credit restoration, is it's totally legal because they're not charging you any money for that. They're charging you money for your membership. That is an extra free bonus in your package. And the way they're doing it legal, where you're kind of doing your own restoration, and, you know, they do make you sign quick documents so you read that so you understand the, the credit restoration part of it. Because it's so, credit repair is tightening up. Credit restoration, credit repair, it's tight and not a lot of companies are able to do it legally and correctly this is one of the few companies that can offer that because they're offering it as a extra benefit so all these other stuff they got going on at NWR Financial so it probably will trump my software business and probably be my number one company but what I like my software business it gives me quick large payments of $200. So I want to promote that harder because the cop plan with NWR Financial guys, you all can afford to get in it. You only have two plans. You're either a customer, you pay a hundred bucks, or you want to be a partner, you pay 150. It's not that expensive. Most of you spent that on companies that you didn't, didn't benefit you in any way. You basically getting money back when you plug in your paychecks, they're gonna show you how you gotta make some more money back to cover that. And then you just sign up three people, guys. You get three people. Don't wait on your sponsor spillover. Get three people in. You know, it's possible to get spillover, but don't wait on your sponsor. Just get three people in, and you already have another person in your house, most likely. Every single one of you got well, I'm not going to say every single one of you, but there's a few single people out there. But most of you have a girlfriend or a wife, a husband or a boyfriend in your house. Get them signed up when you show them the benefits. So now you only need two more. Get family members in because those are the people you really want to benefit. But I get it. If you don't want to market this to your friends and family, you don't sell to anybody. You do what I'm doing. Create a podcast, a YouTube channel, an email list, and just blast it out to enough people. Eventually, you are going to get signups for this, guys. It's pretty affordable, and it's worth every penny. This is one of the few network marketing companies I say is worth every penny. NWR Financial, worth every penny. My software business, that's your bigger ticket uh, offering. You want to put that in the forefront and promote that the most because MWR, to me, MWR Financial should be a no-brainer. I get it if people want to think about my software business because not everybody needs that. You know, it's really just a quick way to help your business get some higher ticket money. But I like my software business because I promote other things in the background of it. But MWR Financial should be a no-brainer for all of you guys. What are you waiting for? You all can benefit. Even if you have an 800 credit score, the other stuff in this company will definitely help you improve your financial life. And guys, if you're thinking like me, you want to get that house next year. Maybe not this year, 
but by next year you want to have all your ducks in line because they have ways you can get land through MWR they have their contacts and it's not like Troy's contacts these people are vetted Troy likes to just bring somebody aboard he never even talked to him I just signed up two days after y'all no it's not gonna be one of those this company has it so that this stuff is done the right way guys they have to because they're under the microscope because they are a network marketing company they have all their ducks in line and their competitor company got shut down because they were only promoting credit repair NW finance NWR financial is not just credit restoration it's not just credit restoration so I just wanted to let you guys share that with you guys let you know where we're at you know um, I think my plan is going to go probably as well as to be expected as far as me building out the company in the next six months and building up some corporate credit. Um, at the very least, I'll be a month shy of my goal. But that's what we're going on forward. I'm going to build up this company, um, fund it any way I can, and show you guys that our goal might shouldn't necessarily be all trying to get rich but a livable wage can be accomplished from gig economy you got your online hustle so it doesn't have to be a job and you can easily make you know two to six thousand dollars a month if you combine all these efforts like I'm trying to combine watch me work subscribe, like, comment, and I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. Thank you.